It's Chris and Abed here from Random Recess, and we're excited to bring you a special preview of one of Austin's most beloved holiday traditions, the Zilker Park Trail of Lights. This is actually the 59th annual Zilker Park Trail of Lights. The trail consists of over 2 million Christmas lights. It's got over 90 lighted Christmas trees, and it's got over 70 other lighted displays as well as lighted tunnels for you to explore, enjoy with your family, and just have a jolly good time. Plenty of stuff to check out. They have several stages set up all throughout the park with live music and bands that play throughout the night. In addition to live music, there's rides, local holiday eats and treats, and don't forget pictures with Santa. Have you guys been naughty or nice this year? Let us know down in the comments. Abed's been naughty, but I've been a perfect little angel. I've been so nice this year. It doesn't even matter if you've been naughty or nice. Everyone can come down to Zilker Park to check out the Trail of Lights. So let's not waste any more time. Let's get in there. Wait, 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 hold on. Something doesn't look right. Much better. Now we're ready for the Trail of Lights. You know what time it is. It's recess time. Right outside of the Zilker Park Trail of Lights is the Zilker Park Tree. And this is an Austin staple, and you gotta do it when the Trail of Lights is here. It's a huge tree that's actually really cool. When you stand in the center of it and look up and spin around, you see a little spiral. So we'll throw a little video in there to kind of like try to convey what it looks like. You gotta do it in person. It's just a tradition. Come here with your loved ones and your family and just spin around the tree till you get super dizzy and fall over on the ground. All right, y'all, Trail of Lights fit check. I had to wear my holiday shirt. What do you think? Am I going to a holiday party or am I going bowling? Chris, how about you? I'm wearing a green hoodie and a blue shirt. Womp womp. <laughs> I'm not as cool as a bed. A bed really dressed up. I did not. You know, I came from work. What can I say? Sorry, guys. Next time. Boo, boo, boo. Boo, I know. At least one of us is representing for the holidays. You may recognize Zilker Park from our ACL video. This is where Austin City Limits Music Festival always takes place. So we're very familiar with how to navigate it. But we're right here at the Grand Entrance. Located near the Grand Entrance is the ZIP Entrance. ZIP is an upgraded ticket type. So Grand Entrance is where everyone's gonna come in. If you upgrade to the ZIP ticket, that's where you'll get your own entrance into the Trail of Lights. And then if you're really fancy, if you wanna buy a platinum ticket for you or your group, there's a platinum private entrance with a platinum lounge. And of course, we'll show you as we walk around the Trail of Lights where all of this is located. If you spend a little bit more money, you don't have to mingle with the common folk in the grand entrance. You get your own entrances. We're actually here on December the 1st for a special preview night of the Trail of Lights before it opens to the general public. This was a special ticketed event. So some of the stuff that we show you tonight may not be available when the trail opens to the general public on December the 8th. The Trail of Lights runs from December the 8th to December the 20th. 3rd, except for Mondays, it's not open on Mondays. And starting the 8th, there are three different ticket types that you can purchase. Check the website to make sure that you know when the free nights are, and also know that those are the busiest nights. For general admission tickets, they could be up to $8, or like I said, free. So just make sure to check the website to determine if it's gonna be $8 or if it's gonna be free. General admission gets you admission into the Trail of Lights. It does not include parking unless you purchase the shuttle pass, you get the shuttle pass, general admission to the Trail of Lights is included. The next ticket type is the ZIP pass, and that's gonna be $25. With the ZIP pass, you get your own entrance into the Trail of Lights so you can bypass the GA entrance. And if you're really willing to get a little bougie and spend a little bit of money for $95 to $435, depending on your group size, you can purchase a platinum ticket. But you get a platinum entrance, you get golf cart transportation around the Trail of Lights, you get a VIP platinum lounge, so it's up to you. You can come do it for free or $8 or you could spend a couple hundred dollars. It all depends on how you want to experience Trail of Lights and we'll leave that up to you guys. The Trail of Lights in Austin is a unique experience and event. It has its own foundation. And what's so great about it is the proceeds from each year go to pay for the next year. So come out here, support the Trail of Lights Foundation and enjoy the park, enjoy the holidays and keep Austin weird. So the H-E-B Cafe right before the entrance actually has some small bites from local restaurants like Sway, which is a really good Thai restaurant here in Austin. And I had to grab a little spoon. 
All right, located right outside of the entrance, they have an open bar for beer and wine. Cocktails are inside the park, but I got a Stella, and we're gonna get this party started right. Cheers, everyone. Uh, it's like empty in here. This is awesome. Yeah, this is really cool. I thought it would be sold out, but it's not. I know it's a special preview event, but this is literally going to be the most empty that you're ever going to see the Trail of Lights. I don't think I've ever seen this tunnel as clear as it is right now. I don't know. What about you, Abed? So far, it doesn't seem like the preview event is sold out. So hopefully it kind of stays that way. But again, the money is going to the foundation, which is a good thing. Plus, how cool is this? You have it to yourself. Yeah, it's actually awesome. Normally, it's like packed wall to wall people. And it's nice to just have a little bit of elbow room and some breathing room while you go see the, the gorgeous lights. This is beautiful already. Uh, justice for King Triton's abs, where are they? It's just a smooth slab. He's supposed to have a six pack, what's happening? All right, y'all, don't forget to stop by the photo opportunities here in the trail, like this photo frame. Make sure to pose and take your pictures for IG because they're gonna look great. The Trail of Lights is a little over a mile long. It's about 1.2 miles of walking. So if you need any sort of assistance, just keep that in mind. It is one point, about 1.2 miles on pavement. This is on an asphalt road. Let's go see what's in Candy Cane Lane and I'm gonna get drink number two. We're here at the Twinkle Tavern inside the Trail of Lights and I had to get a vodka soda because I'm watching my carbs. So low carb king, vodka soda. It's an open bar, so you gotta get stuff to drink. We got some nachos from Cabo Bob's and we're gonna go check out what they have from Loro. There's so many little plates that are being offered by a lot of really cool local restaurants here in Austin. We're gonna go check out what other food they have and maybe grab another drink. Cause you know what? We paid for this, so we're gonna get our money's worth. Leave it to Austin to have a space Santa. Am I right? How cool is that? Yeah, yeah. We're ready to go into Candyland. Come along. Taddy, look, Beauty and the Beast. A tale as old as time. Hey, look guys, it's the energy trucks that help keep our power on when the grid fails. Shout out to Texas's horrible power grid. <laughs> All right, welcome to Cartoon Land. This is so unique. We've got Snoopy, we've got Alvin, we've got Underdog. South Park is here. Uh, and who's that? Dora the Explorer. Oh my God, oh my God, oh my God, oh my God. That is hilarious. Whoever did that deserves a raise. You see that, Chris? The Homer meme. Homer meme. <laughs> Okay, that's awesome. The Homer meme. We've got SpongeBob, we've got Nemo, we've got Mickey, Snow White. This is neat. You know what? I would watch this. I would watch this mega movie. This is the Avengers of cartoons we need. Compared to Peppermint Parkway, which you drive through, Trail of Lights is a walking trail. There have been years where you can actually drive through it and walking is not permitted. But comment down below, what do you prefer? I'm kind of on the fence at the moment. No, Abed, I'm on the fence. All right, y'all, don't leave Chris hanging. Give this video a like for that terrible dad joke. Is that even a dad joke or is it a daddy joke? Shh, I don't know. I told you Abed was on the naughty list. All right, there's so many Dr. Seuss characters. There's one fish, two fish, red fish, blue fish, cat in the hat, the Grinch. There's no Yurtle the turtle. Yurtle the turtle. Say that 10 times fast. Yurtle the turtle. They need Yurtle the turtle in Seussland. Come on, I'm gonna fill out the feedback survey and they're gonna hear all about it. It's Karen. Karen White. We're here near Santa's workshop and just know that that line is going to be very long. During preview night, the line is super long already. So we're not gonna wait in line because A, we don't have children and B, is it weird if two 30 something year old guys go visit Santa Claus? I don't know. You know, if we wanted to sit on his lap, that's a little weird. And that would definitely get us on the naughty list, I think. But that's neither here nor there. You know what, if you want your pictures with Santa, make sure that you get here, stake out your spot in line and expect to wait just a little bit. All right, should you feel inclined, they've got letters to Santa here. You can write yourself a letter of everything that you want for yourself, for your family, for your friends here at the Trail of Lights. This is a really cool experience. Now we're standing in the bat cave tunnel, which is cool because there's bats all over the place. If you didn't know, Austin's actually home to one of the largest colonies of Mexican free tail bats in the entire world, located under the South Congress Avenue bridge. So when you come to Austin, don't miss out on the bats. And when you're at the trail of lights, check out the bat cave. 
All right, walking through the bat cave, this is really neat. It's one of the best tunnels, I think. Of course, you got bats all around. And some of them are even upside down, so that's pretty cool. Look, one of the bats made it all the way out here. That's cool. It's like Batman. Welcome to Santa's Toy Factory, where kids enter, but no one leaves. This is really weird and creepy, but you know what? It fits right in for Austin, I guess. <laughs> All right, here inside Zilker Square, you'll find Donner's Depot, which is a cool little dance hall. They have a stage with live music. And at the bar, they actually have Garrison Brothers Whiskey, which is a local Texas whiskey that's actually very expensive. So to have this on an open bar is uh, kind of impressive. So I had to grab one. And you know what? I don't know what drink this is for the night, but who's counting? It's an open bar. They save this for like the towards the end of the trail which is probably smart because if they were at the beginning, there would probably be none left. So very smart, Zilker Park, I see you. All right, cheers everyone. I had to get another Garrison Brothers because it's expensive and this was free, free, we paid for it. But look at this cool guitar setup. These lights are so pretty. And the music is bumping, it's awesome. Love live music. It's part of why we love living in Austin. It's the live music capital of the world. So check it out when you hear at the Trail of Lights. There's three stages with live music all night long. We had to get a couple shots. And Abed even took a shot. And he's not even a bourbon guy, and he said he liked it, so. And Chris, I'm not a bourbon guy. I'm a bourbon man. I am now a man. So just know when you come to the Trail of Lights, there really are only two rides. It's the carousel and the ferris wheel. We haven't seen any other rides here, so these might be the only two, and the lines will probably get pretty long, so just know that before you come. If you want to ride either of these rides, you're probably going to be waiting in a line, so take that for what it is. We're not going to ride either of them because we got to go get another drink, but you know what? If you want to ride the rides, that's up to you. Uh, I don't know if this is Zeus, but... This is what I'm talking about that King Triton was missing earlier on when we saw him at the beginning. Those abs though, you know what I'm saying? Give him the abs, like this guy. All right, y'all. The name of this installation is Bert Rental. I love it. Look at the mustache. So cute. You know what? 10 out of 10 for the pun alone. Gotta love the dad jokes. All right, y'all. Like a moth to the flame, we are drawn to this H-E-B sign. And we're gonna talk about it because no one comes for our HUB. No one is coming. No one does more for us in Texas. If there's a disaster, who shows up first? HUB. Okay, Abed is right. If you're a Texan, you know the value of HUB. Howard E. Butts, he's the greatest thing that ever happened to Texas grocery stores. Oh, this again. Yes, this again. I'm sorry, Kroger. I'm sorry, Whole Foods. I'm sorry. Wegmans, I'm sorry, public. You don't hold a candle to H-E-B. H-E-B is the shit. H-E-B is the shiz. And you can't deny that. If you're from Texas, you know nobody matches it. Uh, and just so we're clear, we are not sponsored. This is not sponsored by H-E-B. But it could be, but it's not. But it could be, but it's not. All I gotta say is butter tortilla candle. It's still talking? Mm. Butter tortilla candle. Yeah, they have candles that smell like buttered tortillas. Publix, you ain't got that, sorry. I don't care if you have the weir weird subs that have like fried chicken tenders in it. Sorry, Publix subs are really good. I can't hate on those, but H-E-B is better. Sorry, H-E-B is better. All right, the I heart you at the end of the trail. So cute, a bad, I heart you. See, angel, angel. No, Chris, this is the only angel here, sorry. A bed's gone rogue. He's just walking. He's just walking into the displays. All right, get get back on the trail. H-E Buddy. It's H-E Buddy, yes. Little known fact, a bed actually used to dress up as H-E Buddy. That was a long time ago. Our, H Our grocery store have mascots. Yeah. Right? A giant has grocery a bag. Is a giant grocery hey, hey, bag. Hey. He's a real thing. Okay? He's a real thing, and a bed used to be H-E Buddy. Little known fact, but now you know. All right, we want to thank you for joining Random Recess here for preview night of Austin's Trail of Light. We've had a blast. We hope you've enjoyed it. If you're not already subscribed, join the Recess fam. We'd love to have you. Yeah, hit that like button and hit that subscribe button. And you know what? Share with your friends, comment, do whatever you want. 
We love you guys. Thank you so much for watching. Happy holidays. And when you come to Austin, hit us up. Send us a DM. We'd love to show you around. But definitely come to the Trailer Lights at holiday time. Okay, so we don't actually offer tours, but we'd love to talk to you. So DM us. But maybe we should. Do you guys want that? Until next time, y'all. We'll see you on the next recess. Bye.